Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I am going to be showing you guys our RC 124th scale track we ended up building. Um, we have our own little 124 scale crawlers, so we ended up wanting to build a track for it. Um, this is what we have so far. It's uh, pretty big. Right here for the first uh, kind of little thing we built, um, we put a bunch of airsoft uh, BBs in there. So when you go across it, your tires are just going to keep spinning in it until you get across. And if we come over here, we have a bunch of spray foam, and we built this out of wood, this little tunnel you can just go through. And then we have a bridge that connects over there, coming all the way over to here, which then we also have some little sticks we found in our backyard that we just kind of put here around some spray foam. We, uh, we colored it with some spray paint uh, to kind of make it look a little bit better. Then we have two sticks that just we have going up to here, which then you can go over the bridge. Or, this is our hardest one after because we had to cut the bridge. You can go down that bridge, but it's, we're still trying to figure out how to get it from our vehicles hitting the top of the bridge. And then right here, we have just some uh, pieces of wood we cut up and we put with um, some old tires we have for the RCs, just a bunch of spray foam with some screws and you go across and then if we come on over here we built um, this which just connects, we had to put a bunch of wood because it kept falling just going up to this platform that just goes up to here it comes up to here to this where you can go down and that's, and then you have this right here that you can come down off of and then go. And then right here we have uh, just a bunch of spray foam with an old uh, tire that we had that we just put around some spray foam. Some more sticks over there. These are actually the old tires I had on my uh, Red Cat that don't work anymore. They ended up breaking the one piece. And we just kind of put them here so we can use them another tire and then we have a bridge that just goes right through there that we can come through and that's kind of it that we have we are going to expand the track um, a little bit more we this is just what we have right now that we just kind of decided to build we are going to have more videos on this track and today we are going to be running the 124th scale crawlers Okay, so here is my 124th scale um, Jeep. This is the uh, the Axial, and I don't have any upgrades on it yet. I just kind of made a little lift on it with the shocks, but um, I will be getting more upgrades for it um, later on, so I it will be able to perform better on this track because there is a lot of things that it just can't really do without. Um, upgrades on it like this is a little hard for it, but my brother's his is more upgraded than mine he has better shocks he has tires so he can he can do this a little bit better than mine can like mine probably is going to struggle a lot here i might flip if i don't okay, there we go We are now up here. I'm going to uh, go over the bridge right here. Now we do have some stuff on the bridge. We have some screws, so it's going to be hard that you will get high centered on it. So it's not that easy. And then we have some other stuff. And I will be upgrading mine to perform as best as it can. This, kind of like where my crawler is, kind of like that area in this bridge, is kind of the hardest part of the track that we have because over to the other part that I showed of the track is kind of our easier spot for them because there's not much there that's really hard. Uh, my high center, there we go. Seems 
since I am stuck, so I'm going to recenter myself because I will fall if I don't. Now let's try to get across here without falling. Ready? Go. Okay, here we go. I got up onto the uh, box we have, and I'm gonna try to go down this, and that was a horrible start, because with this we've made it just to the point to where if you don't line it up, you're gonna fall. We made it just a little bit wide, like a little, almost too wide to where the crawlers don't have enough room for the wheels, but if you fall down like kind of midway already, that is kind of just easy to get down because you'll just ride it for the rest of the time, but um... It's, not, it's kind of the other side that's more difficult. So now we are over here for uh, this part of the track. This is this was the first thing we built, and this is also kind of like uh, the last obstacle. If you don't line it up, you'll probably most likely fall. But it's not too too hard, but it's enough to where you will flip if you turn the wrong way while driving. You will fall. Another hard part that we have on uh, our track, you gotta kind of get some more speed while you're going through it because there's a big uh, lump you gotta get over and it's very hard for mine because I don't have much upgraded tires on there so I don't have much grip. But it still does very good with no upgrades. And this is the uh, little ball pit we, uh, we made with all the BBs. Now, we will probably expand it so we have more to run. So, for right now, this is kind of just what we got. And this is really it. And um, this over here, this part right over there, is very hard for uh, mine and my brother's because his his um his can do it but it's very rough like i'll i'll try to uh to show you all mine and you guys will see eventually my uh my brother's is he's riding his and his is much more upgrade than mine so i probably will not be making it up this but i will be letting my brother have a chance at it to See if he can make it. I think he's made it once out of the whole time he's had his upgrades on his. But we might have to do more to it so we can make it possible for all of us to get up it. But but um, that's kind of kind of it for our track. And that that other piece right over here, that piece of wood right there. We don't know what to do with it yet because it hits the top up there of the uh, bridge. But if I come back over here, my brother did end up making it up there. And he can make kind of that harder side easier. Like he can make this easier because his is lifted up more. The bridge is easy for him a little bit. But that's kind of it for this video. So... If you guys enjoyed this, make sure to leave a like and subscribe, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.